subscribe, click the bell, and turn on all notifications. The one-stop destination for all WWE and AEW. Sean's View Entertainment. Wherever you may be, whatever you may be doing, this is the Brash and the Brazen, Sean's View Entertainment, and we got breaking news as concerns a WWE Raw star is sentenced. Are they sentenced to life? What is going on? And no, it is not Sonny Tammy Cinch. No, not that at all. As a matter of fact, it's a current Raw superstar, and they're sentencing uh, the courts. We're going to get right into it, but again, very Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays, Happy Hanukkah, Kwanzaa, whatever it may be. Sean V. Damon is here for you each and every day because I provide it to you. Ladies and gentlemen, we got a lot to get to, so we're not going to waste any of your time. Please like the video, comment, subscribe. Make sure to become a channel member today or donate in the comment section by sending a super thanks donation to show your appreciation for Sean's View Entertainment. So, ladies and gentlemen, to kick it off, breaking news. According to the sports entertainer, Cody Rhodes quitting the WWE after signing a new contract. Say it's not so. The real reason. Seth Rollins is sad goodbye. WWE Wrestling News, really? First of all, we can say that Cody Rhodes will not be quitting. As a matter of fact, Cody Rhodes signed a contract to the WWE that will keep him in the company for the foreseeable future. As it concerns the sad goodbye from Seth Rollins, there is no goodbye. Because here on True Interview, not only do we talk about rumors, news, and headlines, we also clear up misconceptions. We also clear up the lies, the BS, the bigotry. We, we, we clear up all of that to get into the actual real news. Now, yes, sometimes news happens Sometimes rumors don't come all the way, but Sean V. Damon, that's why we do multiple videos a day so we keep you in the know on all the latest and all the greatest. Also, ladies and gentlemen, the authors of Payne's official WWE return date is being revealed online, and it looks like they're going to form some sort of tandem with Karrion Cross on the blue brand. Also, viewers, fans, and subscribers coming in from there in a hostile environment that's such as the WWE. This news is just coming through. Right now, WWE canceling Randy Orton. Yes, they did cancel Randy Orton in a way of they've canceled Randy Orton's new updated and upgraded theme song. Yes, Randy Orton came back to his original theme song voices. But as we all know, there was a revamped version of Randy Orton's theme song. And for whatever the reason, the WWE scrapped it. The WWE said, no, we're not going to go with that. We're going to keep it Randy Orton's original song. But what the WWE did do is they used the new version of CM Punk's theme song, The Cult of Personality. And we got breaking news as it concerns the best in the world, CM Punk. Because, ladies and gentlemen, the record is being set in stone. Because the record is being set straight as it concerns CM Punk, who we all know is a member of the Raw roster. He is on the red brand of the WWE. And, ladies and gentlemen, just come through my desk right now. CM Punk's attorney is setting the record straight as concerns when is AEW and W when is uh, CM Punk going to leak out and when is he going to drop a pipe bomb on AEW and all the things that happened backstage and what really went down when is CM Punk going to set the record straight well ladies and gentlemen there is an NDA at hand where uh, CM Punk would be sentenced. It, it, it's sentenced forever as concerns the best in the world. CM Punk will never be able to have anything to say. He will never be able to go out in public. He will never be able to go on a ramp. He, he will never be able to go on a pipe bomb about exactly what went down because CM Punk's attorney says, yes, there's an NDA and it's forever. It's sentenced forever and CM Punk can never clear this up. He can never talk about it. He can talk about it behind the scenes, but he can never bring it to the forefront where it's in the public. Ladies and gentlemen, your thoughts, your comments, and your opinions on that. Also, ladies and gentlemen, ex-WWE star Teddy Hart's court date has been pushed back to a later date as well. There's a lot of talk in the news of that also. The untold truth about the origins of WWE's recent trend of massive talent contracts is being leaked online on the dirt sheets, the websites, and the newsletters. But viewers, fans, and subscribers, as you know, Sean V. Damon always goes above and beyond the call of duty for each and every one of you because I believe in my viewers, my fans, and my subscribers because we do this multiple times a day and we do it in every single way. Ladies and gentlemen, a former WWE star is announcing the birth of their first child. Also, there is a feeling from those in the know that if MJF does come to the WWE, that he should be signed to SmackDown, and that people see shades that, that they believe that MJF could be the next Randy Orton. Your thoughts, your comments, and your opinions on that. Do you believe that at the end of the day? Ladies and gentlemen, again, Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays, Happy Kwanzaa, Happy Hanukkah, whatever it may be. Sean Fiona Team will always give you the spice of the life. And I will give you multiple videos updates because Sean Fiona knows that it's all about you and, what, and wanting to get what you want to know and what you want to see and what you want to hear. Later.